Ha! Huh. Guys, you know when you're so hungry that you feel a little shaky, a little off? That's me right now. I didn't eat breakfast. I <laughs> I didn't have any protein shakes in the house, so I was like, I'm gonna film this huge taste test video. I'm just gonna wait, and now I literally feel like I'm gonna have a meltdown, girl. I am parked at Taco Bell Lake. I might jump in. I might jump in, find a fish, make some sushi. So today we are taste testing six new fast food items that I haven't tried, okay? We are going to Taco Bell to try the new cheesy jalapeno Mexican pizza. Sounds iconic. The rolled chicken tacos, which are returning items, but I've never had them. Arby's Big Game Burger, which is like elk and mooses and Santa's reindeers all in a burger. Sounds terrifying. They also have a new Philly cheesesteak. I'm gonna try that as well. We are also trying KFC's new wings. Can't wait for that. And last but not least, Wendy's new pumpkin spice frosty. So it's gonna be a very big meal. We are filming this back to back, restaurant to restaurant, and I'm, and not, I'm doing not doing it doing alone, alone obviously. obviously. Alejandro loves to do this intro where he like arrives into the car, so this is our third time doing it. <laughs> He's so cute. Bless his heart. The love of my life, Alejandro, will be eating all this with me, and we have a massive life announcement that we're going to be talking about throughout the video, so stay tuned. It's actually a big deal, and I'm <laughs> it's a big deal for my career and for us personally. So welcome, Alejandro. Get in! Hello, bro. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? Bring it in. Bro. Say hi! Hi, guys. Are you excited to try all the new fast food items? We are very, very hungry. He didn't have breakfast either. I got a stomach pain when we were before coming here. I was like, I'm gonna pass out. We have to go. Literally. Do you know what we are trying today? We're trying a bunch of things. All I know that we're starting with Taco Bell, and I wanna go eat. Let's go. I was like, you're coming with me, girl. So Taco Bell's right here. We're Let's gonna go. go right now. Let's make sure everything's clear. Okay, we're good. We're good. So we are first going to Taco Bell, and we are trying... Do you know at all? Something, something Taco Bell -y. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> My belly's full of taco. I don't know. We are it? trying the cheesy jalapeno Mexican pizza. Cheesy jalapeno. Oh, it's a Mexican pizza. Yes, but uh, it has cheese Mexican and jalapenos on top. It has cheese. Yes. Oh, wow. Dairy. <laughs> and we are also trying the new rolled chicken tacos, which okay. seem to be like a chicken taquito, basically. Um, and you dip it into their spicy ranch. They're very dippy lately. Yeah. Very covered in cheese. I am loving it. Taco Bell is in their <laughs> dipping era, girl. You know and I mean? it's delicious. Okay, yeah. we're here. Now I can focus. Um, the line's very long, and it's three pickup trucks in line. Literally three <laughs> pickup trucks. Straight men central. We're going to fit right in, bro. I know, bro. I can smell the... Uh, the women Just inside those. making my tacos. <laughs> <laughs> Get in their kitchen and make me a sandwich. <laughs> it's a taco place. They don't make sandwiches. Do I ever cook for you, Zadi? I no. do sometimes. I've I make him chili. I make amazing chili. Once again, a straight man's okay. specialty. I think you only make chili. And you make it very good. But I'm every single time you make a new recipe, which is very, very funny. Every Maybe single time he's, don't he's say like, it. this is my favorite recipe. I love this and I'm like, yeah, well, next time it's gonna taste different, for sure. <laughs> I made him tater tot casserole and I think I put way too much cream of chicken soup and way too much sour cream. <laughs> it was real soupy, girl. You should be in Barras. And I, listen, nice. I still devoured it because at the end of the day, it's tater tots and tater tots are always good even if they're just floating in a pool of cream of chicken soup. So, are you excited to announce our big announcement? I am definitely very excited. Ooh. We just came back from a place. A, a very mysterious a place, place that, that we've never go. been to. Never. Yes, it was Narnia. Yes, we did <laughs> we ride Aslan. We had to go to the closet again, but we are out again. <laughs> Girl, Aslan pushed us back in. He was like, get back in there. Honestly, I feel like I'm, I'm like being kind of quiet, and it's because I'm so extremely hungry. They it is currently 11.32 a.m. That is very late. Uh -huh. And I haven't had breakfast yet. I haven't had breakfast yet. No. <laughs> There's not one crumb in my stomach. Yeah. That's true. This is true. This is true. <laughs> Have you guys no seen um, Planet of the Base? It's this like meme song, and the girl that sings it is so iconic. It's such a vibe. By the way, guys, if you're enjoying this, give it a big thumbs up. It really helps my channel out. It helps both of us out, okay? Mm -hmm. So give it a thumbs up. And if you want more of Alejandro, give it a thumbs up too. Please watch the entire video. That's oh, very that, helpful yeah, as well. But um, subscribe. Subscribe to the channel for future content. <laughs> Travel and taste stuff like that. Hotels. Mm -hmm. Eating. 
chewing, Swallowing. digesting. Here we go. Okay, here we go. There. Girl, no tension, no tension, girl. What is this? <laughs> Hello. Um, can I get the cheesy jalapeno Mexican pizza? Okay. And two of the um, rolled chicken tacos with the ranch. The two pack? Yeah, the two pack. Okay. And um, a large Diet Coke. Okay. Um, and that's all. Thank you. Yes. Uh, no, thank you. Perfect. Thank you. I love the Hikatsas. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. He's always so nice. Oh, oh, I have you seen know him, him like a thousand times. And he's always like, I got you. And I love that. It makes me feel like protected. I got you. I got, I got you. Human. Remember when the guy in the other video called me my dear and I literally melted? That was oh, we are so sad. That was a Burger King. That was a Burger King. That was a Burger King. Who <laughs> was that Dunkin girl? You weren't there because I showed you the video. I, and I was like, you told me my you dear. You filmed so many videos. I don't remember. Girl, all these fast food workers just want a little piece mm. of us. Hello, how are you? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Thank you. Okay, girl, let's go park I'm... and talk about like. Ooh, smells like. What? Everything that I've ever smelled before. Ooh, here. it smells so good. I oh, I smell jalapenos. Like like strong jalapenos, girl. I just smell like the pickly tartness <laughs> the pickly of it all. Pickly talented. The, the wickedly <laughs> talented. Oh, my phone. Ah, careful, baby. My phone. <laughs> I'm driving here, girl. 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 Once again, the huge pothole next to Taco Bell Lake they haven't fixed it. is not fixed. It's massive, guys. It is like the size of a person, I think. Isn't it? I'm such a good driver now, aren't I? A little close to the curb, but it's fine. <laughs> like, like on an <laughs> I'm like on the grass. Okay. <gasps> I see the taquitos. I'm shaking. I get a table. You don't. Sorry about it. Girl. It's so fast. It's okay. a little crazy. Okay. Napkins. <gasps> Let's first get the taquitos. Here's the spicy ranch. Talk about spicy ranch is so good, guys. Okay. I don't think I've ever tasted that. Before. You have it? It's the best thing ever. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. It's a little off white. Give me my taquito. So this good. is the. Ooh, it smells like a fried taquito. This is the rolled chicken taco. It looks like any store bought taquito, but just crustier. <laughs> Flakier? Flaky. <laughs> Let's first try it by itself and then with the ranch. Mm. It tastes like a really good store store bought ranch. taquito. Let's see with the ranch. Wait, wait, wait. And that's it. But but it's good. It tastes like frozen food. Mm. It improves it. The ranch brings it to life, girl. Does it? It's pretty cheesy. Is it? Look at that. Mm-hmm. Huh. Oh. Um. It's really hot. <laughs> I'm so hungry. Mm-hmm. Wow. It's actually extremely hot, though. Mmm. Yeah, I'm not mm. gonna finish mine. You're not gonna finish it? No. Be honest, girl. If you don't like it, say it, girl. I don't. At all. Oh, no, no, I do. Oh, you do? <laughs> you're like, just say it. <laughs> no, I hate it. So, let's rate it. Mm. You done? No. Oh, you wanna so, do you want to rate it? Yeah. Okay. Mm. What I liked about it was the fact that it's more crispy than your typical store-bought taquito, especially on the edges. A plus. And I think that's because it's deep-fried. Store-bought oh, taquitos that was, that was are cooked in the oven, at least at home. Mm -hmm. So they do get crispy, but not that kind of crispy. I appreciate the crispiness. Yeah. The flavor, it's okay. It's your typical store thing. So if you want like a better like crunch and texture, go for Taco Bell thing. But, I will uh -huh. say I think it's a little 
stronger in flavor than a store-bought taquito but at the end of the day it tastes like the same it thing just like plus so it's like taquito plus mm -hmm. like disney plus but taquito it's a little cheesier a little tangier and possibly the tiniest bit spicier than this, your typical taquito. I don't think the ranch added anything, to be honest with you. It's, it's, just, it's just a sauce that you add to it to make it amazing. less basic. That's probably what they add the, the, the sauce to it. Well, to me, the ranch is amazing. And so, overall, I'm going to give it, without the ranch, a 5 out of 10. Because it's just kind of basic. Uh, no. Oh! Twins! Uh. Oh! But with the ranch, I'm going to give it a nice 8 out of 10. It, like, th that ranch adds such a tang and a spice and a creaminess to any item, and it just really pluses it. So that's my rating. What's yours? I'll give it, with or without ranch, probably a 5 out of 10. When I go to fast food places, I go to taste things that I cannot get at a store. Yeah, And this tastes true. just like a 0.1 of a taquito. I just go to Publix and buy a taquito. And if you have a deep fryer at home, you could literally like replicate this at home. Just like throw them in there. No, that's true. This is the cheesy jalapeno Mexican pizza. Uh, oh! Girl. Did they grow? Oh, wait, did it grow? <laughs> did it grow? Have they grown <laughs> since the last time I did had it a Did it grow from the earth? This is it. It looks like, you know, it's been through it. It has been through some struggles, but guess what? It sure. stayed strong and came out the other end. <laughs> well, it's gonna come out the other end, girl. So, um, it isn't very pretty. It's and it's not very bright. <laughs> it's not very bright. But, um, it smells like very strong nacho cheese and very strong jalapenos. Wait, pause. Let's, let's get the thumbnail quickly. Uh. 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 Oh, closer. Like, yeah, there. Oh, okay. Let's try it. Take a slice, Daddy. Oh, they actually cut it in four. Yeah, it's funny. Well, that's like the least delicious looking slice. Take Girl, a good I'm one. Sure. It's all falling into one place. You know what? I want, I want that big slice. You better say that one for me, though. So that's it. I'll take the biggest slice there the Mexican is. Pizza was, <laughs> the, Mexican, the Mexican pizza, remember, it was my favorite item at Taco Bell. Oh, I love it so much. Let's try it. I can get a jalapeno. Mm. Mm. Let me get a jalapeno. Hold on. Let me add it right here. Did you get one? A jalapeno? Okay. I think I did. Okay. I just got it. Ah. Ah. No. It's a Mexican pizza, so it's delicious as always, right? But it really doesn't taste that much different from your typical Thank Mexican you. pizza. Do you agree? I, I was like, I don't want to be the, the the bearer of bad news. Yeah, I was like, oh, I will have to say that if the jalapenos were stronger, that will kick you out. Yeah, like the jalapenos spicier. are numb. They are very tame jalapenos. Like numb. So. Oh, thank God. I was like, oh my God, people are going to hate me. <laughs> Question, because you have eaten this more than I have. Do they normally have the regular one, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Take your time. Mm. Do they normally have uh, the greens inside? Green? Um, lettuce? No. They don't? No, girl. They never have? Never. Oh, then I don't know what I was thinking about, but like, it tastes the same? It has all the same stuff that the Mexican people has, right? Beans, meat, the crispy tostadas, the red sauce, the shredded cheese, but it just has a little bit of nacho cheese mm -hmm. and a few jalapenos. The nacho cheese does add a nice cheesier flavor, but just not that much, like a hint. It's a hint. And then the jalapenos, <coughs> while they do taste like jalapenos, once again, they are not spicy whatsoever, at least to us Cubans. They just weren't tangy enough either. Like they just didn't stand out. It just, it tastes like any green, it's door locked. Any green topping. The Tokyo guy. <laughs> what was that to you? Overall, it, it was, was it was delicious, but nothing new, nothing, nothing iconic, fresh. Nothing iconic, not reinventing the pizza. I think I will give it, I would say, a 5 out of 10 again. Okay. So both of the items were kind of mediocre for me, at least. Uh, talk about they're not impressed today. Taquitos 1.0. Plus, and then if the if the gag is to like have nice cheese and nice jalapenos, they were not there. Yeah. They were present, but they were not here. 
they weren't the stars. No, they were and they not. They should have been the stars. They were not. They so were not. I am going to personally give the Mexican pizza. If it was just a normal Mexican pizza, it would be a 10 because I, I love Mexican pizzas. But it's not. But because it's supposed to be something fresh and different and new, I have to give it like Imagine a 4. Imagine if you're coming excited just to, oh my God, I'm going to try this. Yeah. What? It's and it's just thing. like same old thing. Like that's how they get you to come back to the restaurant. That's why they always have like so many seasonal items every single time. They don't, right? Yeah. It's just for you to come back. Uh, we're not coming <laughs> back. We're not. Yeah, uh, girl, I am. Every day of my life. <laughs> Next up, we are going to KFC to try the new crispy wings. Are you excited? If I ate on a KFC, it's been probably... A long time. Twice. Well, KFC's chicken is soggy. It's not good. But this isn't their fried chicken. This is their chicken wings. So yeah. it might be totally different. Never tried it. Very excited. See you guys there. Gobble, right. gobble. <laughs> okay, guys, we are two minutes away from Kentucky Fried Colonel Mustard. I think that every single month, I become an even better driver. And now that I've done two road trips by myself, I'm I'm a pro. Like, I you're never like, make mistakes. You're like a pro driver. I never make mistakes. I'm always slaying it. And I feel like I am better than 99% of people on the road. Honestly, like, Especially people, in South Florida. people should follow how you drive. Yes! Wait, I need the GPS. For real, I feel like and I'm a good example. One, turn right. I yes. Know. Yes, I, I agree a hundred percent. Are you being supportive or sarcastic? I can't tell. Not at all. <laughs> oh God. You're such a great driver. Is the sarcasm in the room with us now? So in the last time that I came to this MKFC, I was doing a letting the person in front of me choose um, challenge. And the person in front of me chose a chicken leg, coleslaw, and a biscuit. It a was chicken leg? What's a chicken leg? <laughs> Chicken, they have legs. Chickens have legs. <laughs> Can I have a chicken leg? Yeah, no, like, like an actual no, leg. Like, that's not the item. A name. drumstick. That's their leg, right? Just call it drumstick, not Without chicken the little leg. Claw. I don't know. A chicken. Leg. I'm pretty sure the item is not like called KFC chicken leg. No, I think it's, I think it's a drumstick, <laughs> okay. right? Okay. It was just the most upsetting meal I think I've ever had in my entire life. Ever? We're here. I oh my God! They have a chicken like a chicken corral. It's well, not. a chicken leg. Like, what do you mean? No! Look at that red thing. That's a seating area with a gate. It's not a chicken coop. It looks coop. like a chicken coop, yeah. A coop. A coop? Wait. Oh, I passed the drive through Oh, did you? What a great driver. Shut up. I was distracted by the chicken corral. It's funny. I've never, again, I've never, like, we live here for, like, so many years. I've never seen this KFC. Ever. Because you don't ever want KFC. Every time Listen, that I'm like, they have they have chicken tenders, they have fries. Do you He's like, always like, KFC is disgusting. No. Do you love KFC to get it? Uh, oh, no. I'd rather get something else before, before KFC, personally. If I'm really craving their mac and cheese, yes. Because that's a special mac and cheese. They sell chicken. It's not called mac and cheese KFC. Oh, there is hot I and spicy wings. You want to know something? You want to know something? Oh. The poster of the promo that what we're getting is on the gate to the trash dump. <laughs> <laughs> there. You see it? Girl. It's literally on the doom. Not, not the trash poster, girl. We're next. Hi, I'm going to Hello. Um, can I get um, an eight-piece Hot and spicy wings with a um, ranch on the side. Just a wing, um, just a wing. Yeah, just that. All right, you have a piece. Thank you. You're welcome. Five thirty-four. Five thirty-four, not bad. This is a very tight little um, drive-through space. It's mm -hmm. scary. No. I almost went over that curb, girl. So the car in in front of us is a QX60. What's the brand? Infinity. Thanos likes his chicken wings, girl. You're supposed to laugh. Hello, how are you? Hi. Any hot wings? Yes. Alright. Thank you. I'm excited for these. What is the hotness level? There you go. Do you want any sauce? Uh, ranch. Sure. Thank you. Um, Steph Pull Papa's. Pull that back the door for me, please. Okay. Oh, thank thank you. you. Steph Papa's tried these wings and she loved them. They looked so crispy. So, so it got me very hyped to try them. Because Steph Papa's knows her stuff, girl. She is that girl. Baby, baby. Oh. Thank you. Have a good day. Thank you. <laughs> Pull the window more up. Oh, I see a beautiful shaded spot under a tree. Yep. Okay, we're parked. Give me that wing. Smell it. Mm -hmm. Thumbnail. I don't like the smell. It smells like chicken. You want a KFC? Get your KFC. It smells like an old house. Like, it smells like an old carpet. Oil from last year. 
Yeah. You want to take a peek? Oh um, my. It's giving ancient oils. Okay. Okay. Come now. Well, let's first now? open it together. Let's see how it looks. Open one side. Oh. Oh. Those look so good. What do you think? Show them, baby. Oh my god. Look at that. What do you think, baby? I'm a little freaked out. Okay. Ah. Uh. What? It smells better now. I think that the packaging might be um, causing that old house smell. You know what it is? I think it's because it's like closing the, in the enclosure. Yeah, so I it's think it's, it's breathing now like a wine. Yeah, it's like the chicken's breathing. It's like, oh, mm. bad breath. Okay, first without ranch. Yeah, first without ranch, but let me just open and get it prepared. And then after this, we're going to announce our big announcement. Here you go, sir. Is there a little chicken hair on that? Girl, don't say that when you give me the chicken. <laughs> you know when chicken wings have like the little hairs from the feathers? Delicious. Okay. okay, one, two, three. I just got breading. What do you think? So what did the regular wings taste like? I don't know. I don't remember. It's not spicy. There's some, it's pretty spicy. There's some spiciness in there. Then I need another wing. Mm. I don't like that. You don't like it at all? Just don't like that. Try a, try a flat. Wait. I don't say, oh, here. Try that. There's actually hairs in there. Yeah, it's little chicken hairs. What the hell is that, baby? It's a chicken I hair. I thought you were joking. No, it's, see, it's right there. I thought, <laughs> Look at that chicken hair, girl. It has a whole wig. I thought it was a joke. No. What? It, that's nothing to be afraid of, girl. I love it. Um, I'm trying it with the ranch now. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah. With the ranch. Better with the ranch? Mmm. I need more ranch one. Let's see that. Mmm. Nothing. Mmm. This is my third one already, girl. Okay, I need ranch yet. Let me dunk it. Oh, you haven't tried it yet? Mm. I have a little. I want to dunk it well. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Okay, I'm done for now. Napkin! In the back. Oh my god. What do you think? You go first. Okay. So, I am not in love with the quality of the wing. I think that it could have a lot more meat, and the meat itself is a little too, too greasy. It's just a little too, like, thin and greasy. You know what I mean? But... That's <laughs> 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 <So> greasy <laughs> But... <laughs> I have to say that I really do love the breading. I think it's extremely crunchy, and on the outside, it is not greasy at all. There is a good amount of spice, but it could be spicier. Um, overall, though, I do like the flavor of the spice. I feel like it's actually a bit tangy. Almost a tiny bit like buffalo-y, but like dry, like dry buffalo, you know what I mean? So overall, I'm impressed. I'm not slay, but I'm impressed. I'm gonna give it um, a nice seven out of 10. I like those. I think I like the breading. The first two wings that I had, most of the first bite was just bread. I like what they're going for with the flavor and stuff. I still have like some spicy spiciness left in lips. my throat. <laughs> uh, but as I was eating it, I couldn't really taste anything spicy. I taste it really? now. No, no, I taste oh. it now. Uh, I think with the ranch. Oh, the ranch elevated. Really, it really, really did. It made it better. And um, I appreciate that. Thank you, Colonel. Colonel. <laughs> Thank, you, chicken. Colonel. Thank you, Chicken Leg. Um, <laughs> Colonel Harland, ha Harlord Sanders? Harland. There is something like missing. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's quality or something. They felt kind of like... Empty on the inside. Whatever. To be honest with you, I, I don't know. And that's probably... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I, it, 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 it was just... It was just a chicken wing. You don't have to know. Did you rate it right? No. I would say... I would say another five. So today's the day of five so far. Uh, well, next up bad. is Arby's, girl. And, and, and they have the elk burger. We do love Arby's, so... You know I mean, why? Do you know why? They got... They got the, the meat. 
<laughs> exactly, Zaddy. They got that. And today they got elk. <laughs> what now, is elk? Like, like a Christmas elk? thing? <laughs> a Christmas thing. Elk is a type of, uh, it's part of the deer family. It's part of the... It's Christmas! It's part of the buffalo family. It's part of those. Wow, the economy is over. Even Santa Claus is selling his elk. So. <laughs> <laughs> take it, girl, Arby's. Take, take all my Take me. all the elks. Okay, so oh, yeah. should we announce the announcement of our big announcement? I think we should save the announcement for like... Something uh, like a better restaurant, like Arby's. Okay, you want to do it there? Yes, okay. let's do it there. So I just told him to start recording because he's going to freak out. What? So there's a spider in the car. In the car? Inside Baby, stop it. I kiss I'm not. What do you mean? I'm not going to put this in. Wait, what? Where? It's a tiny one. Where? Wait, do, just tell me where so I can see it's it. It's like on so my side, distance. don't worry. It's on my side. Uh, it's like a tiny thing. Really. Yeah, so they got inside baby, your car. Baby, why should we start feeling? Ah! I was like, I was like, okay, well, I have to, we have to record. No, this, baby. So. There's a tiny spider in the car. His car was parked for like a week, so. Baby. I got it. It's not even moving. Keep it's track of it, please. It's still there. It's a tiny baby. Just like put it outside. I feel bad if it's a baby. Well, it might be a, an, an adult tiny spider. <laughs> Do you want me? Hi, sir. <laughs> How old are you? <laughs> I just need to know. Do you see it? No. It's right there at the, the point of your uh, wind uh, blade thing. I'm focused on the road, girl. I can't see it. Okay, wait, wait. Just park first. <sighs> oh my God, I'm shaking. Maybe it came in when, when your uh, window was open. Yes, it's right there. You see it? Uh, oh, I see it. Oh, okay. It isn't one of those super scary ones. It has like the really long legs, so it's like, hey, girl. <laughs> Peer yeah, out! It's right. like, ah! She's like, hey, daddy. Oh my god, what is that? It's a daddy long legs. Hey, hey daddy. daddy. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know what to do with it because I don't want it to get hurt, but Turn right onto North I don't want it in my no, car. Right to go in. Do we have like a paper or something to like lift it up? Okay, I'm gonna get rid of the spider. Okay, but we have to order. Oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. Don't hurt it. Go okay, ahead. guys, he picked it up with a napkin and we think that we set it free outside of the window. She lives. Oh my gosh, I feel bad. Hello, how are you? Uh, can I get the big game burger? No problem. You want the problem? Um, by itself. Okay, no problem. Anything else? And then can I also get the uh, new um, Philly cheesesteak? Is it is it here? Do you have it? Yeah, we do. Okay, perfect. I'll get one of those you too. You want classic or bacon ranch? Bacon ranch or classic? Yes. Um, bacon ranch, yes to both. Okay, no problem. <laughs> and you just want the cheesesteak, right? Yeah. Uh, uh, I um, and then can I also get a large Diet Coke? No problem, yes. And that's all. Say that again? That's all. That's all? No yeah. problem. Thank you. So nice. So nice. Can I get this? No. Problem. <laughs> said, no. I said, no. No. I was like, no. Problem. No, girl. No. So nice. And that was my best ordering yet. Do you agree? Girl, at this pace, she's just gonna start working in there. I'm just gonna talk, 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 talk forever, girl. Hello, how are you? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Can we get a refill? Let me just keep this strong. There you go. Thank you. Oh. I'm excited for the big game burger. Um, I have to look it up and see exactly what kind of animals it has elk. in it. The whole farm. Yeah, it has elk. Listen, Wendy, you know her? Of course. Wendy Girl with the red uh, hair, pigtail. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Wendy lives on the farm. She, she is does? The f yeah, you know that? No. She has a whole farm. I thought McDonald had a and farm. And she sleeps in the barn. I thought McDonald had a farm. And I think. <laughs> McDonald had a farm and Wendy's in the barn. I think that Arby's took all the animals from Wendy's farm who, and put them in a burger. Who is Arby's? Arby, Who is she? Arby is a man Are you sure? that likes his meat. Arby sounds like a very nice old man. <laughs> I have never met a man that doesn't like his meat. That's a lot of meat to handle, girl. Yeah. <laughs> Out of Mr. Arby, Ronald, Wendy, Zaddy King from Burger King. Out of all of them, which one sounds like the funnest person to eat with? Me, Wendy. She's a very. She, she's, she's that like, girl. She's like. She's the moment. <laughs> she's the moment. <laughs> she's the moment. And she knows how to build a camp, cause she lives on the farm, so we can have a nice cookout. Also, girls are better. That's that's the girls tea. are better. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. You too. Okay. 
so nice. Love him. This parking thing is very like paper. Yeah. <laughs> Girl, what do you expect? Honestly, plastic. Have you not heard about the turtles? They need you. I honestly didn't feel like this special in a while. <laughs> okay, wait, hold on. Let's see what is in the big game burger. Oh, there it is. Oh, it has antlers. Do you think this is a game? Well, it is actually the big game burger. <laughs> That's why I said it. Did you get it? <laughs> it's so funny, baby. Okay. <laughs> That's what made me love you. So the big game burger features a unique blend of venison. I don't know who she is. Oh, uh, that's like a deer thing. Elk and ground beef. So at least we have some cow in there. Those two taste nasty, so they just put the ground beef so you'll get like... The cow one. is a friendly taste. No, <laughs> face, a friendly, a friendly face to our taste buds. It is 34% venison, 33% elk, and 33% ground beef. And it has Swiss cheese, crispy onions, sweet garlic, and dill pickles, and a dark cherry steak sauce. Ooh. Dark cherry steak. Oh, my mouth watered. Oh my God. So first we're gonna try the Philly cheese steak. So this is literally brand new. It came out today. Oh, open it. really open today, it. today? Yeah. Whoa. I'm gonna say what's on it. Oh wow, that's a, uh, that's a residue. Look. <laughs> residue. Look. It's all stuck. Oh my, oh, that's so my good. Oh my <gasps> Wait, take this off too. Oh. Oh. Open it, open the flap. Okay, so this has caramelized onions, American cheese, fire roasted red and green peppers, and Parmesan peppercorn ranch topped with bacon on a toasted sub bun. Oh, it smells, oh, it smells like too much. It I just don't really wanna strong. get messy. Well, you're gonna, girl. This is all part of the game. The big game. Try it, girl. Oh. Oh my God, I'm scared. I'm actually scared. You want me to go first? It just is so messy. You want me to go first, girl? <laughs> 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 Ooh. Oh, what do you think? Feed I me. think I like it. Feed me. Two bites before I even get one, girl. What kind of relationship is this? Oh, this is the bacon thing. Come on, feed me. Please, <laughs> show it to me. <laughs> mm -hmm. Baby, come on! You're so, this is wrong, it's my channel! The bacon is amazing. <laughs> Ew, but, baby, you spit all over me. <laughs> Look at it, oh, what? Ew. Girl, wait for the elk. <laughs> You're dripping on onion oh! legs. I like the bacon though. Oh my god, I can't taste anything besides the cheese sauce. Ugh. The cheese sauce is so overpowering. It, there's so much of it. Everything is just swallowed up by it. It tastes so processed in a bad way. You guys know I love processed cheese. This is like not it. It's, you know what it is? It tastes like hot pocket cheese, but a lot more tart and strong. Oh my gosh. I literally can't taste anything besides that. I hate it. That's horrible. I would never get that again. I don't want another bite. I don't ever want to see it in my life again. Oh my god. Um, it's actually not bad. So. <laughs> Tell us your thoughts, sir. Girl. They got the meats. They got the bacon. They There's got the cheese. There's barely any beef on there, girl. Baby, it's full of meat. It's all cheese with like a hint of baby. What a sprinkling of cow. Baby. I will, I will have to say the best bites were the one that the bacon is in it. So without it, I don't know. Would I get this again? No. Who do you think I am? But <laughs> honestly, um, it just is a mess. It's a very messy eat um, dish. Um, you know. Honestly, Let you know see. what? Also, I think that the ranch does not go well with the cheese sauce at all, and it what gives ranch? it. There's ranch in there. It's not there. And it gives it a more salty, strong flavor. And it almost gives it like an acidity that reminds me of like an acidity. You know what I'm talking about? It looks like it, like it. It reminds me of that. There's a there's a tartness. I got really? the shivers. I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm I'm giving that a zero out of ten. Zero. No. Horrible. Baby, come on. And I was so pumped to try you it. You have eaten worse things than that. Okay, a one. Uno. Uno, papi. <sighs> Okay, so there's a story behind that. Back in the day, when I was like a teenager, I used to go to the mall and I would walk around the food court over and over getting samples. <laughs> one day, one Oh, really? <laughs> they told you uno, papi? One of the workers was like, uno, papi, sorry. Which and I was like, like oh God, I was so embarrassed. I thought that I could just like slide by. You, you wanted know? to game the game. 
it was part of the big game. I just feel like I have a very like typical look, like like I'm not that recognizable. You know what I mean? So I'm like, I can get away with getting a bunch of samples, but nar, they caught oh. me, girl. Yeah, that was horrible. Now okay. it's time to try the venison. Wait, wait, I haven't. You forgot about me. I oh. haven't rated it yet. Oh, rate it. I will give it. I don't want to do this. <laughs> Maybe a four. Oh, buddy, honestly, actually, that is generous, girl. Buddy actually, That's Ellen. Buddy actually tastes it. Tastes it. <laughs> <laughs> you just got it? No, I don't know. You say Ellen, I remember that. Go on. But it actually doesn't taste bad. I just don't know what I'm eating. And most of the time when I eat like sandwiches and burgers and stuff like that, I am never going to pick this kind of sandwich. Like it's like a lot of meat in like a bath top of cheese. I don't need that. So I'm giving it a four. <laughs> is it like a one, like a zero, like he said? I don't think it is. It's just a mush of sourness. Ugh. Okay, that is honestly the worst Philly cheesesteak I've had in my life. Yeah, I don't eat Philly cheesesteaks, and the fact that I like it better than you, that's probably telling that. And the fact that I'm an RB stan. I know. And I always give them the benefit of the doubt. Like, I love their meat, I love their products. This is not it. So, sorry. Now let's try the venison, the elk, the deer, the cow, the bull. I did take a peek at the game burger. <sighs> let's see it, And bro. the patty look, looks like a turd. Um, <laughs> because it's it delicious. Oh! Look how dark that is. Girl, that's intimidating. Girl, that is, that is a brownie. Girl, that is, that is going to force me back into the closet. Girl. I don't like it. Well, listen, I'm not going to judge a book by its cover. I'm going to give it a chance. Of smells course, like, I'm a taste tester. It's my job. Smells like burgers and french fries. Smells suspicious. Smells a little sinister. You first. Uh, I'm excited for that dark cherry sauce, girl. You like cherry? Yeah. Here. Scared. Oh, my God. Yeah, I am scared, too. Enjoy the farm. Oh, oh. oh that's a meaty bite. Oh, my God, it's so big. Oh. I can see the elk walking around in there. Oh. I'm scared. Let me try it. Again. Feed me. Feed me. <laughs> Feed me. What's that from? Oh, no. <laughs> Feed me. It has a different refined burger taste. No, come on, baby. Eat it. Chew it. Oh my God, today everyone is like on the floor. Baby, chill, you haven't even eaten it. <laughs> this one. <laughs> there's, there's a taste in there that is bringing me back to a memory and it's kind of freaking me out. I think I just got it. But not the outside. It's a like gamey. Yeah. Oh, the big game. It's gamey. No. Oh, no. The big gamey. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Ah! I mean, mm. you know what it is? Our the oh. out, the outside bites. The outside bites are colder. Listen, oh, I'm sure. baby, just throw it away. No, I'm gonna swallow. I'm not, I'm not being rude, like you. Oh. I think yeah, I got the gamey, but like no outside where the burger is cold. The inside, which is still steaming, that's what I got. The weird meats taste. And I still have it in my mouth. It actually reminds me of like very cheap burgers in Cuba. The burgers in Cuba are very simple and stuff like that, right? So it's like a very low quality moment. Taste, taste. I'm not saying that the meat is bad quality. I know they had burgers in Cuba. Do they? I mean, are you gonna go like, do a taste in Cuba? So let me explain my reaction. When I lived in Kenya a couple times, we ate goat meat, okay? I have nothing against goat meat. People that eat goat meat, that is like totally fine. Personally, for me, as a kid, I really didn't like it. It has this very greasy, gamey flavor. And this burger had, had the same gamey flavor, and it really brought me back to that. Yeah, watch that. So I think that it's more of a personal memory that, like, upset me, if that makes sense. But I will say it has that special flavor that if you're into these meats, it's got that weird flavor. I would love to... It doesn't to, taste like a typical burger. I would love burger. to have, like, that sauce or something on, like, a regular burger. So, I think I'm gonna give that burger another 1 out of 10. Both of the Arby's items for me are a 1 out of 10. I'm so sorry about it. You guys know I am never this harsh. That just shows how much I really did not like these items. And I'm really shook about it. I feel yeah. like maybe, maybe I'm evolving and I'm turning into like 
Gordon Ramsay, you know? I will give it a three. And this is a three, a three. Treak. No, three. Fork. Chook. It's a duck. It's a really dumb TikTok that we love. Wonk. Listen, I give it a three because it is edible. You can buy it. You can eat it. But okay. is it enjoyable? No. So it's a three. Wow, that makes absolutely no sense. But, Literally. you know, you're a guest here, so you're not experienced. I am a like guest. Me. I am a guest. Yep. So, big news. Out of this sea of like mediocrity food today, we, we are... We have a big announcement. Yes. We are... Pregnant! Ah! <laughs> oh, 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 what was that? Oh, girl! Oh, my God. Why, something <laughs> pop? Is it, is it your fountain? <laughs> my water! No, we are, we are not pregnant, but we are... Moving, Moving to where? To, to Orlando. Oh! <laughs> well, we are moving to Orlando in November. And you might be thinking, Timmy, are you moving just to be closer to Disney? No. Are you living in the castle? I'm growing a wish. I want that slipper. No, that is only part of the reason. So we have been talking about moving to Orlando f probably for the last five years. Three. Then, uh, three, three, I think three, around three. <laughs> and yeah, all this time it wasn't, it was never the right time, and we were never like, oh, we want to leave or anything yeah. like that. It's just like, oh, in the future we wanna, we wanna go there. Yeah. We've always wanted to move there because rent in Central Florida is way cheaper than South Florida. I am talking like one fourth cheaper. Okay, and so that was always the main reason. We were like, why live? at the bottom of Florida where it's pricier when we could just move closer to Disney and all those different things. And also, it just so happened that now my channel is going in a more travel-y, theme park-y, food, hotel and direction. And that's Orlando. That is the capital of hotels, every restaurant, and every theme park, literally. So it just so happened that like all the stars aligned and it's just the perfect time to move now. And we're just so excited. Mm -hmm. We just came back from seeing uh, our Fisher place. Our apartment. It is like it is stunning. It's like, stunning. Stunning. Like like you don't understand. Like okay, it isn't like fancy, right? But like visually, it looks so much nicer no, 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 than no. our current listen, place. Listen, listen, listen. So it much is, nicer. It is newer, cheaper. Way cheaper. More stunning, and. <laughs> like better like I mean it's in Orlando for your channel that's great it so is close to everything it is a lot of positives and of course when we move I'm gonna give you guys a little quick apartment tour things like that and um what else we're just very excited like uh I'm gonna have to get a new job yeah. which is stressful yes. uh we're gonna have to get like new like everything like new main doctor like we're like three hours away from where we live for now so oh, yeah it's, it's like a, my family lives down here so I'm gonna have to travel to see them so it's yeah. like a whole different dynamic just right now feel like the right spot and it's just a more fun area outside of content we have so much to do there it is just it's a whole different vibe, and I love that vibe, too. Like, there's just more trees, less palm trees. I know that people love palm trees, but I don't get it. It's a stick with, like, Angelica doll we hair. Are, listen, listen, listen. <laughs> we have been lying, you know? We're just moving because we just write regular trees. Like, we don't like palm trees. Yeah, that's here. the only reason. We're, <laughs> we're going to climb all the trees. So, of course, I will um, keep you guys updated on the move, right? As, like, um, time goes, we have around two-ish months yeah, left. Yeah, we're already... <laughs> We already are packing and like throwing away. <laughs> We're stuff. already packing, girl. We're like throwing away stuff, <laughs> donating stuff, uh, organizing closets, fixing, and like. We still have like a long time here and we're like, oh, I, I, I want to go. I want to go. <laughs> yes, girl. Okay. And listen, our closet took forever to clean because both of us lived in there most of our lives. So did you get it? But did I get it? Lived in the closet for my life. Oh, I got it now. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I was waiting for that. That was a really good joke. It actually did take a while to clean out the closet. And I am going on one more Orlando trip before moving. Um, I am going in about a month. And I have a hotel review lined up. I'm so hyped about this hotel, guys. And um, I'm also going to Animal Kingdom and um, Hollywood Studios. So I'm gonna do those three videos, so stay tuned for that, subscribe. It's gonna be incredible. And then once we move, I can make as much theme park, restaurant, hotel content as I could ever want in my life. So, so it's just perfect. Okay, so sorry about that abrupt ending. The camera overheated mid-convo. We're too hot. 
but um, we just want to say final thoughts on that whole thing. We're just so excited and very exciting. And we're going to take you guys along with us on this whole journey. You guys will see everything. It is honestly a new chapter because we've always lived in South Florida for like the past, what, you, 10 years, me, like 13 years, 14, no, like 16 years. So in our adult lives, this is our first big move. Oh, it's my turn. Hello. Um, can I get two pumpkin spice frosties? What size? Uh, medium. Mm-hmm. Um, and that's all. Just two of them. First one, though. Thank you. Oh my gosh, guys. I almost called it McFlurry. I McFlurry? don't know why. I almost called it that. And so I was like, Frosty. But once again, I ate all four fast food interactions. Tell me you're proud of me. So proud. Oh, the pride just gives me power. A lot of times it's like, do you notice? And I'm like, no, because. Because he's so used to me slaying it. Exactly. So I'm like, so I'm like, oh, I'm very proud. But I'm like, I. This is just you now. Yeah. It's who not, you are. To that you have slight every order. Thank and you, my love. But I do still have my days where I get very anxious and then I get yeah. get stuck again. But I would say 80% of the days I'm like really chill. And I couldn't have done it without the love of my life support. He has been with me every step of the way. He was encouraging me to get speech therapy and everything. Did we talk about this last time? You have to talk about this every single video that I'm with. I know. <laughs> you talk better because of me. Exactly. Not because you put there on the work. Exactly. Nothing like that. Talking to you, sir. <laughs> Master. Hello. How are you? Hi. Thank you. I think there's a bee. I think that flew in. It's gonna make this very sweeter. Honey. I'm excited for this pumpkin. I really hope it tastes good. I've been wanting to try it for like a month. I'm so hyped about it. You guys know I love. Pumpkin pie. Thank you so Thank you. much. Oh, here? Yeah. Oh, wait here? Okay. <laughs> no, oh, go for oh, it. Thank, okay. <laughs> thank you. I'm so awkward. Hello. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you so much. Oh, so orange. Thank you. Have a good day. That's very orange. Oh, that guy is so cute. Like oh, that guy is so cute. Oh. Damn. Yeah, extremely orange. Yeah, it looks no, like No, it's a... not orange. It's like brown pumpkin looking. No, it's like bright orange, girl. It's like mustard. Show them close up. Okay, we're in oh a fine shade of places, Spark. Everyone promoting the football game like, we park here? I hate this. No, let's go over here. <laughs> yeah, let's go the way What football game? It, it, look, knock it, knock we it We don't away. talk about that on my channel. No. All this ice. Okay, here's a nice shaded area under a tree. Love it. Yes. So the camera doesn't have to fry. Perfect. Slate it. Love it. You want your <laughs> spoon or a... I want a spoon. <gasps> it smells more like a caramel coffee moment than... Pumpkin. I think it's a mixture of both. I don't know, guys. I'm kind of scared now. I just need at least one item to slay me today. Just We've one. We've been in a sea of like mediocrity today. Yeah. It's all about the big game, guys. Oh, look at my nails. Aren't they stunning? Guys. Ready? Okay. Let's try it. Oh, straw. Ooh! That is a liquid pumpkin. Oh my god, I like it. The first straw. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, it is strong. It's like it's like pumpkin, like the, the the top of the pie. Yeah, I don't like how it smells because it smells like a fake coffee creamer. You know what I'm talking about? But it tastes like a pumpkin pie with a hint of fake caramel in it. You know what I mean? Just a hint. But I really like it. It is pumpkin spice for like galore. So if you're like if you're one of those like Starbucks girlies, like can I get my pumpkin spice? <laughs> yeah, this is you. It's very cinnamony. Cinnamon, 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 cinnamon. Mm. It's basically mm. liquid pumpkin. If you want liquid pumpkin, that mm -hmm. this is it. Very creamy, just like your typical frosty, but with a pumpkin pie flavor. Mm. I wish you had like pieces of crust in it. Oh, oh girl. Oh, I wish. That. What? We'll that would we'll eat. Mm. Oh, I am giving this a nine out of ten. Oh, I'm really liking it. It is very sweet though. Oh, you know what it is? There's a hint of eggnog in there. It tastes a little eggnoggy, which I love eggnog. Sorry, go on. I love it. Maybe. Yeah. It's just that flavor is very close to this. Very eggnoggy. 
Mm. I would say for what it is, I would say the look is a little sweet. Like, like I was like, let's just get a medium just in case we hate it. And this medium. Perfect amount. Yes. Like a large pumpkin thing of the, like, bright like this. That's a lot. I don't know. It's just, it's a very sweet. So maybe like a nine or like an eight. Yeah. Because it does accomplish its task. It is a liquid pumpkin moment here. It just is very strong, I would say. Listen, close your eyes. Do not look at the color and just eat it. Honestly, I think that it's more eggnoggy than it is pumpkin-y. This should be called the orange eggnog frosty. <laughs> Do you agree? What are your final thoughts on the whole day, on the whole experience? I am glad that we're smart and we left this sweet for the last thing. And uh, But very mediocre day. Yeah. And I'm glad that we can sacrifice ourselves <laughs> for you guys. So you guys can make better choices. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> You know what I mean? So yeah. This is a win. Mm -hmm. oh, we love that. We love so, a sweet ending. I love ending on a good note. It makes me feel so much more satisfied with my meal. I guess we're gonna say goodbye now. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. It really helps us out. Subscribe. Yes. And if you made it to the end of the video, you're you you're that girl. Amazing. Thank you for taking your time to watch our time to, to be your time. Exactly what, whatever he said, whatever that meant. Bye, Bye love guys. you. Ow, baby. It's cold. <laughs> <laughs>